Hello everyone, let's start with question number 12. So it says the points A minus 1 minus 2, B 4 comma 3, C is 2 comma 5 and D is minus 3 comma 0 in that order from, form a rectangle. So we are saying that what can this rectangle form? So the rectangle can form kar sakta hai? first condition if it is a parallelogram. If it is a parallelogram properties show karte hai, then it could be a rectangle. Second is diagonals must be equal. So, if these two properties we prove that yes, they are satisfying these two conditions, then only we can say ki yes, it can form a rectangle. So, let's start with parallelogram first. For parallelogram, what you need to do is we need to find the midpoint of AC and midpoint of AD. So, parallelogram ke liye condition ye prove karne padegi hume ki hamare dono taraf se Midpoint kya are same are because diagonals kya karte hai pehle logram mein bisect karte hai. Two equal half mein bach jate hai. So, sabse pehle we will write A, B, C, D in that order to form a rectangle. So, sabse pehle pehle logram mein. So, pehle logram ki kya property batai? Diagonals bisect each other. Ab yaha pe iska matlab ki humara jo midpoint hai of A, C and midpoint of B, D. Unko hum देख सकते हैं कि क्या वो दोनों तरफ से हमारा सेम आंसर दे रहे हैं सो so, पहले AC की तरफ से देखते हैं सो so, फार्मूला होता क्या है इट इज x1 मिड पॉइंट निकालने का x1 plus x2 over 2 and y1 plus y2 over 2 AC की तरफ से निकालो x1 from AC this and this x1 is minus 1 and x2 is 2 plus 2 over 2 comma y1 is minus 2 y2 is 5 over 2. so you get half and on the other hand you get 3 over 2 ab dekhte hain from the other side dd ki taraf se check karte hain ki hamara answer kya same aa raha hai ya nahi so b and d b in this case is 4 comma 3 and d in this case is minus 3 comma 0 so x1 is 4 sorry x1 is 4, x2 is minus 3 over 2 and you have y1 as 3 and y2 as 0 over 2. So you get 1 over 2 and you get 3 over 2. Or you can see that the two sides are the same. But if we have made midpoint from AC, then we have made half, 3 by 2. When we have made BD, then we have हमारा half comma 3 by 2 है, so A B C D is a parallelogram. This states that A B C D is a parallelogram. अब next हमें क्या prove करना है कि हमारे diagonals equal हैं. तो आपने क्या करना है? You need to find diagonal A C. A C निकालो और दूसरा आप B D निकालो. So A C निकालते हैं with the help of distance formula. Distance formula you know now. It is 2 minus minus 1 whole square plus 5 minus minus 2 whole square. Then on the other hand you have BD. BD is minus 3 comma minus 4 whole square. Then you have 0 minus 3 whole square. So 2 minus minus 1 is 3, 3 square plus 5 minus minus 2 it is 7 square. So, 3 square is 9, 9 plus 7 square is 49, so you get under root 58. Now, on the other hand, you have minus 7 square, which is 49 again. Minus 3 square is 9 again, so you get under root 58 units. So, dono hi taraf se aapka jo diagonal ka measure hai, it is under root 58 units. So, aap dekh sakte ho ki dono conditions humare paas satisfy ho gai. Iska matlab, that yes, they can form rectangle. So, this is true statement here. So, this is your answer for question number 12. Thank you for watching this. Please like, share and subscribe.